when you got the call to say there's a British middleweight title fight up there for you, how long did it take you to say, yeah, that's for me? About one second. Then you have to think about it because I'm a, I'm a very big light middleweight anyway. Um, and not only that, with, with my training camp the, being the way it is now, everything's on point and I feel I just turned around and I'm a lot better fighter now. I'm, I'm a lot more confident in my ability. Um, I know I can win a world title. So, yeah, I mean, there's a lot of things to, that are playing part at the moment and I'm, I'm a lot happier on myself and I know I'm going to win Saturday and it's going to be a good one. Just before we hear from Mark, what's, what's going to be the key then? What makes you so certain? Do you believe you're the superior boxer or do you have the power or whatever? Or on ability, I believe I can, I can fight in a box. Um, everybody's saying, you know, about, about Mark being this tremendous puncher. I don't, I don't dispute that he, that he can punch at all. Like he's, he's knocking people out. Whether he's knocking, you know, in my opinion, I think he's been fight, knocking over crap opponents. Uh, you know, I'm going to be the judge of that Saturday. It's not as if I'm going to go for a fight and not, not get clipped a couple of times. So, um, yeah, I, I don't think he's quite this, you know, the killer that people are making him out to be. So, we'll see. Mark, listening to that and hearing what he thinks, <coughs> you're not quite the killer that uh, people are making out. What, what, do, you, what do you think of, of him? And what do you think of what you've just heard? I just think he's talking absolutely rubbish. Mark, you know me. You know I can see fear in your eyes and shit in his off. Listen, I'm definitely you not fucking shit in his off. And listen, you I'm gonna knock you off on Saturday. You were skin. 100%. I'm gonna knock you off on Saturday. And if you knock me on Saturday, I'll get up and I'll shake your hand and say, do you know what, Mark? You're a good fighter. Well done. So, but you ain't gonna listen, tell you now. We'll see. Mark my words. We'll see. Mark my words. We will see on Saturday. All right. We will see. What makes you so sure, Mark? Because I'm the better all-round fighter, and um, I just 100% I'm going to knock him out on Saturday. He's had the two defeats against Liam Smith, who's been training with you, been sparring with you. What have you picked up from that? I picked up loads of stuff. Um, other than Liam Smith, who who have you fought? What's what, what's good? You stopped my brother on a call. Who, who, who have you fought? I fought a better opposition than you. Then, then do you, do you honestly it. believe that or are you just saying that? Have you been that. told to say that by a trainer? No, I haven't at all. Of course you have. No, I haven't. Is he fear in your eyes? He's scared. You're looking dead. You're getting your head punched. You're getting your head punched. You're getting your head punched. Thank you, brother. He's had his two big fights against Liam. What did you learn from watching him in those fights? I learned a lot from that. I learned that as a shitbag as well. <laughs> we'll see. You'll see. We'll see. We'll yeah, see. not. Do you care to elaborate on his shit bagginess? <laughs> do, do you want to say a bit more about what you learned from the fuckers? I learned a lot from See, it's more what you've been told to say. I learned that he's a quitter, and when we get into deep waters, yeah, which I don't think it's going to go that far. Who's to say you ain't a quitter? You've never been in an hard fight. Pardon? Who's to say you ain't a quitter? You've never been in an hard fight. I'm not a quitter, mate. Never smashed it. I'm not a quitter. You're smashed. I'm going to smash that nose all over your face. You'll see. 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 Mark. Oh, we need to get personal now, do we? Yeah, you'll see. If you need that, you need it. If you don't get to him early, and if the big punch doesn't work in the first three, four, five rounds, what then? It doesn't matter if I don't get to him early. I'm, I'm prepared for a solid 12 rounds. No, you're not. <laughs> yes, I am. <laughs> Can you take his power? With respect, you've been fighting tomato guns, you've been fighting shit bags. You get someone half a shot and they throw the self respect. <laughs> yeah, with respect. <laughs> with respect. They, 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 just want to, they just want to pick up the money at the end of the night and go home, you know, just just stay safe and just go home and be happy with a couple of quid digits in. But I'm not coming for that, I'm coming to win. And I want to move on to that next level. This, I'm not saying I don't respect you as a fighter, man, because I do. You're a good fighter. But I just believe I'm, I'm the better man. You're not. Definitely not. I am. 100%. We'll see on Saturday. You know it. You know it. I don't know it at all. You do. 
you recognise uh, that he's the hardest test of your career so far, I've got to be. Yeah, he's definitely one of the, the, bad, but the big step up, but he might be a big step up, but I feel like he's going to be one of the, most, the easiest fights in my career. We will see. We will see. That is... Getting uh, knocked out. No one's getting splattered all over your face. Mark, it's been boring. It's been boring. Getting knocked out, boy. Don't miss it. This is going to be a special one. It's for the, it's for the British middleweight title.